Hello, today we're going to look at a group auto creation macro that uses the offset function of the console to create a whole bunch of groups uh, without having to manually create them each time. So we're going to take a look at macro 951 here. Macro 951. And you see that it takes select last, offsets that at odd, record group, and then wait for enter so we can input what group we want it to be at and then it's going to label it for us as well. Um, and then it's going to go on to the next macro um, in the list. And the next macro is create even, create reverse, mirror in, mirror out. Um, and then it ends there. Uh, and then macro 950 is the one that launches it. Um, and you don't have to have that one technically. You could just type in macro 951 and it will work, but I decided to do it that way. So we can like a look, take a look at this running. If we select 101 through 140, which is all of our spot fixtures in this particular rig. Uh, now that we have that in select last, the macro will work. We can just type in macro 950. It has selected odd, and now we just need to place that. So we can just place that at group 1, for instance. Um, and then it is uh, selected even. And uh, instead of typing out what group I want it to be at, I can just select the uh, direct select. And likewise, I can keep going, verse, mirror in, mirror out, and then it ends. And so right now I have uh, all of these pre-created groups. I haven't, you know, it took me a few seconds to make. And you can see that they actually work, that, that this is accurate. This is a mirrored out version of this group. Um, this can work uh, great, for instance, if I just do the first line set of spots and I run the macro, macro 950. I have odd, even, reverse, mirror in, mirror out. Um, and you can do this for whatever offset functions you want. Uh, it's just that these are the ones I chose for this demo. Um, but if you find yourself using like groupings or whatever, you can absolutely put those in and it'll work just great. Uh, this is the basis for this. Uh, I wanna point out one thing though. Uh, so 952, uh, we're going to look at macro 952. Uh, and you'll notice how I have select last, select last, enter. Uh, basically, that resets the select last cycle. The select last cycles through the last five. But if you select last, select last, enter, uh, that means that, that the, it'll basically reset the stack of select lasts. Uh, what that means in layman's terms is that if I press select last, select last twice, it is always going to call that original group that I started with. So it was 101 through 140, for instance, in the beginning. Uh, it will always call that, and I can just do that for every macro, and then I can, that can always depend on that calling uh, the original. So the file is located in the uh, description below, and uh, it'll just have uh, nine, macro 950 through macro 955, so you can start from there. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.